No. for hours. Oh, nose to the grindstone, you know. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since 10 o'clock? Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Right. Brilliant. Of course. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a bug on a drug. Well, come on then. Finish up. Uh, just have a few more pages. I, I, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. Aha! The power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? I'll get a new one. There is now a curfew in effect at night. That's a past we can remember safely. Well, I expect you in the conference room presently. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss the piñata. Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I made her a welcome back, doll. Esther wonders what life's like outside the tube. Of course he'd have to break the tube to get out. Well, that would break it for everybody. See what Miss Bing thinks of you right now, Clive. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that one. Oh. 
I hope I did that right. No, thank you. What's my view? Whatever happened to you, Prudence? You're not coming back, are you, Prue? But where did you go? behind in our work now that you mention it. There you are. You nearly missed the piñata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. You smash it until all the sweets come out. Come on, hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Come on! You are off your joy. Take one of mine. Oh my lord. He's a downer. Call security. We've got a downer. Probably a bad time to ask for that raise. You smell gas? Flame and Nora. Forget him, there's no time! Let's chase me. There were bridges, weren't there? And tunnels. I'm pretty sure I'm not in the parade anymore. I don't even think I'm still in the village. Well, I'm not getting out that way. some bobs and bits of metal to make a lockpick. Prudence really did run off. And she ran this way. I wonder if I'll see her again.
How about Simon Says? I love Simon Says. There we go. Three years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. Hurt you, Percy. I, I promise. But, but, but they hurt the city. I don't think they'll blow anything else up. Why? Because we surrendered. I hope. Well, what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. I'll look out for. We'll look out for each other. First fight I've won since primary school. Actually, I think it's the first fight I've been in since primary school.
Too bad I don't have any other hatches to go to just yet. Parade district, which I just got chased out of. Brilliant. Ah, the train station. If I can get to the train station, I can just follow the old rail tunnel all the way to the bridge. Be nice if there was a map, wouldn't it? I suppose back in those days we could remember where things were. Oh. Berries. They grow all over the garden district, don't they? I guess I can eat these till I run across a pub. coming for you, Percy. I haven't got it all figured out, but I will find you. Well, I hope this doesn't give me food poisoning. Terribly romantic, isn't it? They had each other until the end. It's a bit risky. Look what happened to Goldilocks. Well, that's a convenient story, isn't it? The Germans rounded up the kids at gunpoint, did they? So much better than what we actually did, isn't it?
They all said he was dim. He wasn't dim. He was just... strained. They look pretty well buttoned up. I suppose I can wait here till they throw a party for the whole neighborhood. Or find a cleverer way in. Thank you. My uncle bought it for me last Christmas. Anxious to get back home to the village? Well, I... Uh, well, I live in the parade. <laughs> you won't get past that door. Not without one of them disposable electrical cars that all the bobbies have. And a power cell. Know where I could mug a bobby? <laughs> You're a brave one, aren't you? No. I'll trade you one. Don't you want to go back home? Home to all those bastards who chased me out of my house. When they all catch the plague and die, then I'll go back. There's something I want a whole lot more. Those bastards in that camp over there, with the helmets and the proper weapons. They took something from me. If you get them back for me, I'll give you my card. Sounds quite dangerous, isn't it? Of course it's bloody dangerous. That's why I'm paying you. Come and find me. In that sort of hamlet over there, we'll trade. All right. Well, what are they? Me medals. From the war. I won the DSO at Dunkirk and the Victoria Cross at Ramsgate. Those bastards. They thought it was funny that I still had them. Fucking funny, they thought it was. No, oh, I only need a power cell to fire this thing up. Who'd have stole most of those, too? Right. Well, I'll see what I can do. Well, off I go to heavens alive. It's a bloody fortress. So much to choose from. Mind one of those. Thanks. remember how to make a lock pick.
I feel awful. Not in the next of mine, or failing that some tea to make me throw up. <laughs> Sally would have loved this if I could never get in here. I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. For it. A lovely day it is. Not many people get this bar. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this bar usually puts up a decent fight. In the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you alive. I don't know. Can you juggle? Well, I can write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad first. Put your things in that box. It will leave you there to starve. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth. For it is upon you. Wait, to be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Who gives a shit, Hastings? A newspaper's supposed to make you feel good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. The feeling is muted. 
There's only enough food for the winners, see? Now, lads, change your weapons. One is quite lethal. The other will just give the other chaps some bad dreams. Up to you. That padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? And Danny's picked the lethal one. That's cheery. Hey, little guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. You've got to want to block that. got a sinking feeling. Oh god, this shot. Oh god. sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I'd need a jimmy bar. I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a motoline dispenser.
I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I, I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet like. I definitely don't want a crowd. It's better this way. It's me. Uh, watching the day go by. Just relax. Don't question it. Supplemented by Motley, the fuel of the future now.
so I can go to that hamlet and give that chap his medals, and he'll give me the card I need to cross the bridge. That's everything I had when they jumped me. Getting a bit thirsty. I better find something to drink. Where's a the pub? There's a pump on Barrow Home, isn't there? Nothing personal. Don't think I won't sniff you out again. <laughs> We've come to the end of our time. You can't come to the end of our time. A victory is when you win. <gasps> What's the truth? Is mine the same as yours? They're not coming back. They're never coming back. Sleep. But I wouldn't pay for my shape. And I wouldn't pay for my shape. It's not personal. <laughs> 